Hi Sagittarius, welcome to my channel. Thank you for being here, for tuning in. I'm Valencia with Val Beauty 3 Tarot. And we're just gonna jump right in here, Sagittarius, and see what's going on with you today, all right? This is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Node. And this is a general reading, so of course it's not gonna resonate with all of you, but for more readings after this, please go ahead and check out my husband's tarot channel at Possessed777. And I do offer same-day personal readings. Everything you need to know is in the description box below. Thank you. Right, Sagittarius. So right away, I do see here that you are going, you are ready to go on a journey. You started when you're on this beautiful journey right now at this time. There's something here and that fast, it causes something painful for you that you know is over, but you're not ready to have it be done quite yet. Okay. Now, at the same time, it's put you through a huge awakening and a rebirth of some sort. And you're realizing and seeing the reality of your life and situations and people. Okay. with whatever this may be about. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, it makes sense. It looks like you're kind of having a shocking awakening about your family members or someone you're in a marriage or relationship with, your own personal commitments or a commitment outside of you that you're aware of. Whatever it is, it's not feeling loving it's dysfunctional this you might be dealing you know possibly with your past person an ex maybe or like i said currently you might be in the middle of a divorce or it's like you're and this is only if you're in a marriage or relationship with someone you might only be staying with them for the sake of success and image and you know all that kind of stuff so either or but you know if you're single it's your it's kind of like your own personal commitments that you have something is just not feeling too fulfilling right now at this time Whatever it is, though, you're like, well, whatever. Let me just be comfortable with it. Let me just figure it out and chill and just let me get back to focusing on myself, going to work, figuring some things out here at this time and kind of moving forward with it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, there you are. Okay. So with the money, business and finances, you know, having your own sense of independence, that feels good. And that fast that now you're like, and I'm ready to be guarded. Now I'm ready to defend myself and guard myself from anyone or anything. And then right after this, though, ooh, Sagittarius, you are the most um, extreme one today I've read. You're like, you're guarded, and then you're like, fuck this. You're like, I'm about to do some dark shit right now. Like, I don't care anymore. There's something about this because you're kind of like, you know it's toxic, you know it's addicting, you know it's obsessive or dark or whatever, right? Like, bad, but you're like, fuck it, I'm already in it, I don't care. And then you literally like, and I'm about to be deceptive as fuck too. <laughs> you're like, I'm really about to go in right now and be so mischievous and deceptive and I don't care anymore. So, I don't know. Whatever it may be about. Or towards who? It could be towards a person. For some of you. Okay, but whatever it is, the deceptions and all that, that you're involved in, whatever you're doing, whatever, you know, um, it, so here, a few things here, it actually, it causes you to kind of just be like, you know what, let me just sit with myself, uh, find a moment to be alone, right? And gather yourself and get some information, guidance, counseling, wisdom, knowledge, whatever it is to help yourself in the situation. You end up actually getting the strength and getting up and taking care of things and controlling yourself and taming yourself and doing what you got to do. And even putting up some boundaries between yourself and others, putting your walls up in a sense and really protecting yourself, okay? And this is where right after that though, you're kind of like, okay, well, I, I've done enough boundaries. Now let me go on the phone and creep instead. <laughs> you're like, well, let me see. Hmm. <laughs> you know, so a lot of you end up either maybe messaging someone, whether it's secretly or not, I don't know, or you end up having or trying to manipulate through information so spying lurking stalking creeping obsessing over i gotta find out i gotta find out i gotta find out of information whatever it is okay about a person place or thing i don't know mm -hmm. okay hmm 
Well, it makes sense. It made you spiral a bit more if you did find out information or get something or maybe not. It, it I think, yeah. Okay, you're interesting. You're like, and I don't, whatever, um, Sagittarius, like live your life. I'm not judging you I, I, at all. I, I do see that you're kind of like, look, Val, here's my shit. Here's what I'm in. And look, I'm actually doing study and research and gaining information so I can keep this fucked up circus clown going. You know what I mean? You're like, I want to keep this toxicity going right now. You're like, that's why I use tarot or whatever, you know what I mean? Or social media to manipulate. But it's like you have your reason as to why does that make sense? That's why I'm saying like you're not an evil person. It's like live your life, you know what I mean? You have a reason for why. I just don't know what your reason is and I don't need to know. Um, Because you do the deep research of study and then you know the situation is karmic. Like it's not, it's not meant to be right now, okay, right now. <laughs> but you're like, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> And some of you are like, listen, I know occult divinatory and tarot too, Val, and I'm about to use my tools too right now. I'm like, oh shit, okay. What are you doing, Saggy? Careful. You know, but it's because some of you are like, either I don't care, like, I, I you, like, like you're in that, like, let me purposely be lazy and not give a shit to manifest and co create what I want. You're just like, you're not into it, you know? Others of you that are like desperately deep into like occult, you know, whatever, divinatory stuff, spiritual stuff. To desperately figure out what you can create your intent or what to do others of you you're just like i don't care to figure out what i'm good at right now <laughs> to make money with it you're like i don't care whatever it is it, then it goes into a few things either you don't believe in yourself you don't trust yourself you don't believe or trust who you're with or what's going on or you've gone rogue full-blown like you don't give a fuck maybe a little narcissism i don't know only you know it's kind of like cold unfaithful not trustworthy like that, that's where you're at right now, okay? Towards someone or something. Okay, let's see here. Okay. Ah, ah. But at the same time, you were still willing to invest, of course, in that energy. As toxic as it is, but you have your reasons. And then that fast, the cycle got closed out. I don't know what happened. You, life, someone, a door got closed and you're not fucking having it. You're like, what is going on here? Now you're livid. Now you're ready to fight. Right? You're ready to battle if you got to. Um, or some of you are just like internally being like, what the fuck's going on here? You know? So either or. Either you're going out of your way to fight people, you know, start drama. Or it's more so just internal within yourself. Oh, well, it makes sense. I like how I said that. <laughs> you like someone. It's because, for some of you, it's because there's someone there. There's someone here, Saji. That's what it is. There's someone here. For some of you, it's more so you're just having fun. You're, you're funny. You're like, oh, good. You get me. Good. Well, guess what I'm about to fucking do, bitch? You're like, I feel like if we were friends, you'd be like, bitch, I'm about to fuck this bitch up right now. I'm like, oh, shit, you are. Be careful. I'll be here. I had the food at home. Okay, I'll hang out. You know what I mean? Like, I'm that friend. I'm like, girl, you're about to get in a what a fight? Okay, well, what do you need me to get for you? You need anything? I'll make it. I'll make it your favorite meal. You want to make it your favorite meal? Because <laughs> some of you're like, look, I'm gonna start some shit out. Shh, let me have fun. And others of you are like, no, I'm I'm in this energy because I I feel something for someone. Or you're like, I know who I am and I'm gonna have fun and do what I need to do. Okay. Um, you could be dealing with a uh, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. A Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Thank you. Bye.